I'm starting to wonder why anyone would keep working at Oscorp. I was experienced enough to beat your friends. I am Russian, but I am no friend to those pigs. My name is Sergei Kravenov. Men call me Craven the Hunter. So you left me that note. Huh. Judging from the web, you're one of those crazy reality show guys who runs around naked in the woods eating bugs. How can you help me? I can make you a true hunter. Not just a boy pretending to be a man. Should you wish to accept, you may find me here. Until we... Parker, why didn't you get me pictures for the Fisk Osborne press conference? Oh, sorry, Mr. Jameson, but I've got school. You know, life outside the job. In my day, your job was your life. A press pass is wasted on you. Actually, I just got an idea for using my press pass. I've got to admit, it would be nice not to feel like I'm fighting this battle on my own. But is Craven someone I can trust? Craven obviously doesn't know who I really am or would have come to my house. I don't know. I've always worked best alone. But then again, I've never tried it any other way. Craven can teach me his hunting techniques. I don't have to rely on police broadcasts to find bad guys. It's not like I tell Craven my real name. I'll be on guard for any kind of double cross. I've never had formal training in how to fight. <sighs> okay, don't be nervous. You need information on Craven, and you've got a press pass to get it with. <laughs> Easy peasy. Never mind that if he finds out you're a photographer and not a reporter, he'll have you stuffed and mounted. Mr. Kravenoff? It's me, Peter Parker, from the Daily Bugle. We, we spoke on the phone. Uh, Mr. Kravenoff? This new task force is sending a pretty strong message. No vigilantes. Ah, I do not trust them. They are paid for by Fisk. I am sure you've heard the rumors of his illegal activities. Sure, everyone has. But no one can prove it. And the police seem okay with him. Because he has paid those who are corrupt. The rest are desperate to avoid looking incompetent. Well, the public is desperate for an end to the crime wave. I have only one agenda. To get results. Based on my experience, the uh, research, the police aren't big fans of vigilantes. 
The police had their chance to stop the crime wave. They failed miserably. I, uh, don't think they like being reminded of that. I do not wish to insult them. But it would be a far greater crime to have the power to help, but refuse to act. Would you not agree? Yeah. As a matter of fact, I would. Is man really the most dangerous game? In their own way, yes. But men are merely highly evolved animals. The current crime wave provides fascinating opportunities to study them. So you're saying you feel a responsibility to use your power to help? Yes. To have such power and not use it is to be unworthy of it. Uh, well, thanks. I, I think our readers will find this very interesting. Good, good. I must take this call. But please, look around. Take pictures of anything you wish. Yes? No, I said tranquilizer darts. No, I have no interest in automatic weapons. They require no skill. I'm an artist! Suitable for framing. Couldn't ask for a better picture. The image isn't clear enough. Yuck! Gotta frame the subject better. <sighs> Didn't get a clear shot. That's a beautiful shot. Pardon the interruption. Would you care to see my latest trophies? Spider-Man captured them. An inadequate solution. They escaped. So you killed them? To save the lives of their victims, yes. But also in self-defense. They were deadly opponents. I know. I mean, I can imagine. When do you consider it okay to kill? When there is no other choice. I do not take life lightly. But when it is necessary, I do not hesitate. If my failure to act cost the life of an innocent person, I could not live with myself. I know what you mean. They all had superhuman powers. How'd you beat them? I have trained myself to the peak of human ability. 
and learned many natural means of enhancement. Not drugs, like the scum who pollute the streets, but the secrets of native cultures. Herbs, potions, mysteries forgotten by so-called civilized man. Hunting criminals? Some people might wonder if you're the carnage killer. <sighs> he is no hunter, but a brute, a savage. His very existence is offensive to men like myself. So even though he's hunting criminals, you'd like to take him down? Of course. He dishonors what I do. Without honor, Peter, the hunt means nothing. Last question. Is there anything you haven't accomplished yet? Ah, uh, yes. I would like to leave a legacy when I am gone. Pass my training to a protege. My only family is a brother who... Well, he chose a different path. I never had a son, but... Perhaps... Uh, forgive me. I am becoming melancholy as I get older. So, do you have what you need, Mr. Parker? Yeah, I think I do. Back in jail. Listen, if you're calling to tease me about breaking out... I'm insulted. I can think of a lot more fun things to tease you about. If you're smart, you'll get out of town before I find the time to chase you. Funny. That's what I was going to say to you. Things are getting dangerous around here, Spider. Why don't we chase each other out of town, hmm? I'm too busy to fool around with you. I, I mean, play games with you. Bye, Felicia. what Craven's got to teach me, besides mustache grooming. Well, don't get any ideas about me being your sidekick. I'm on the trail of the Carnage Killer, and tracking's a little out of my wheelhouse. Ah, yes, the killer. I thought he might be you, but I have watched you. 
And I see that you are no madman. You spied on me? Only briefly. There is much a hunter can learn from observation. I see. In the way you carry yourself like a lost child. But you lack someone to guide you. To help you become a man. I have no son of my own. I do not want my legacy to die with me. I can make you the ultimate hunter. Let us work together to... to find this carnage killer and suppress the crime wave. Let us do together what we could not do alone. I'm still gonna operate on my own. Of course, as will I. But we will be there for each other when it is needed. I've heard that. It is tempting to catch the easiest prey, but in our case, the most obvious criminals are the most inconsequential. Wait. Follow them. See where they go. I get that. I'm not gonna let anyone get hurt. If I see these guys threatening someone's life, they're going down. To admit, Craven, all this is leading me to the big fish I never used to find before. Thanks. Like a pride of lions, when the leaders fear an outside predator, they will call their soldiers together for protection. And every crook in New York is afraid of the Carnage Killer. When I find where they're holed up, it'll be like one-stop shopping. You are learning. But stealth is crucial. Even you cannot fight all. Better than that. Just what I needed. Great composition. The trap will be here soon. Get the package ready. I get a photo of that crate of Oscorp tech, so I can trace it. This crate is heavier than your mother! If you drop that, I'm not taking the blame for you! Quick, get the crate loaded before someone sees us! Now that's a keeper. That Oscorp deck will go to their superiors. Do not lose sight of it. I'll stick to it like, well, me.
Sometimes I fantasize about moving to Hawaii, but there'd be nothing to swing from. <laughs> secret clubhouse. tips are paying off. I get the feeling there are a lot of all the places where he killed these guys' friends. A lot more than the police know about. You know what Craven would say. A clearer picture of the Predator's hunting grounds. This is where all the cool gangsters hang out. Hey, pay attention! I'm not gonna do this again for your benefit. Oh, that was fun. You hear? Chris is already cool gangsters hang out. Equipment like this. 
Harry won't mind if I borrow this for a little while. before you see me move. Better go see what that was. Help! I said, did your mom tell you you could be anything you want? Because she was wrong. And of course the Daily Bugle never gets pictures of me winning like this. Take that.
themselves as bad guys, but come on, you must. No. I can check that one off my list. This was not a meeting of the Wilson Fisk fan club. Craven, I'm sending you pictures. The first one looks like a map of places the Carnage Killer struck. Ah, yes. Good. Good. The more we can learn of his habits, the better. Next up is a flyer for an anti-crime fundraiser hosted by Wilson Fisk. I think they're gonna try and kill him there. Even if Fisk is crooked, I can't let them do that. Especially with all those innocent people around. The fundraiser is tonight. They will have put their plan into action already. You must go to the location and stop them. Just one problem. I don't have an invitation. I'm guessing you don't either. Then we must improvise. I am too well known to bypass security. But under your mask, Spider-Man, nobody knows who you are. Here's a hint. I'm not rich enough to go to this. <laughs> 